Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker, the episode 9, the final part, the end of the entire Skywalker saga. And I thought it was pretty good. Rise of Skywalker follows obviously Rey as she continues on her journey. Uh, this time she has a little bit more training. She has been training with Leia for a bit. Kylo has decided to try and consolidate his power and has gone on a rampage kind of because, you know, things. Palpatine's on the return. This movie's awesome. If you're a fan of Star Wars, you're gonna like this. I know it's getting shit on by critics. This movie was definitely made for fans over critics. Here's the thing, I'm not one to say on whether or not you should make it for fans or critics. I typically say you should try and make the movie as good as you can first, rather than make it for one audience or another. But overall, this movie is so good. At least, I thought it was. There are a few parts that you could probably mess with a little bit, but no, what, what we get as the movie is a lot of fun. Uh, we see a little bit more of the Knights of Ren, that's really cool. One of, we learn Ray's parentage, and that, for me, that one was kind of a hard sell, because I liked who it was set up as, and then what we got, the payoff wasn't that good, if that makes sense. I don't know. I personally didn't like who her parents turned out to be. B. The final battle with the Emperor is actually really cool. Like how he ends up going down. Also the final like a uh, starship battle. Oh. Solid, solid, solid work. The way they handles Leia's death. They, they handled that very, very well. They, they handled it probably about as well as they could have overall with, um, you know, Carrie Fisher dying before eight even came out. I don't know, I don't want to get into spoilers. I'm actually gonna make, I want to make another video where I go into spoilers, and that's gonna honestly be very unedited. And by very unedited, I mean no editing whatsoever. Is it gonna be me talking? Um, probably in my chair about spoilers. But this movie, I love it so much. I think that it wraps up this Star, the Star Wars saga, the Skywalker saga, as best as you possibly could because with how 8 um, went and some of the events that happened there, it felt a little challenging and they resolved pretty much every single plot point from 8 in this one. If you're like me and you like 8, um, I would say watch it. Um, if you're like me and you, if you're not like me and you didn't like 8, you're probably gonna like this one a lot more as a Star Wars movie. Though, I think a lot of people's reasons for hating 8 are rather, um, stupid. I go into uh, that a little more in a video that I just put out that I'm going to link in the description down below uh, entitled your reasons for hating uh, the last Jedi are stupid because they are and but <laughs> that's beside the point this movie's great if you hated it for whatever reason you're gonna like this one a lot more fuck the critics this movie's clearly not made for critics this was made for fans this movie was made to entertain us and as a fan of Star Wars I have to say I was highly entertained if you're a fan of Star Wars, you're going to enjoy the shit out of this movie. It's going to be a lot of fun. With what they do with the lore and the way that it wraps up, I thought it was a very solid end to the Skywalker saga. And overall, it was a great movie. And for me, this movie rolls a 17. Really, really, really enjoyable. Things that I thought were kind of dumb. But overall, this movie is so much fun. I highly recommend it to everyone. If you haven't seen this, go watch it you're a fan of Star Wars. If you want to follow me on Twitter or Instagram, links are going to be in the description down below, as they always are. I hope that you guys have a fantastic day, and as always, guys, peace out.